Former President Donald Trump's recent campaign rhetoric has drawn attention for its increasingly offensive and vulgar nature, particularly in his attacks on Vice President Kamala Harris. Over the years, Trump has been known for making inflammatory remarks, often targeting women and people of color. His current focus on Harris has escalated, especially since President Biden endorsed her as his successor in the 2024 presidential race. Trump has used racially and sexually charged language, including derogatory terms and insinuations about Harris's past relationships to undermine her candidacy. This approach, while consistent with Trump's history of provocative behavior, carries significant risks as the election nears. The American public, particularly female voters and moderate swing state voters, may find such rhetoric off-putting. These demographics are crucial for any candidate aiming to win the presidency. While Trump's base might resonate with his confrontational style, there is a growing concern that his crudeness could alienate the broader electorate, potentially costing him vital support. Trump's use of social media, especially his platform Truth Social, has played a key role in amplifying these attacks. On this platform, Trump shares and promotes content that reinforces his offensive rhetoric, creating an echo chamber where his followers generate and spread memes and posts that align with his views. This has led to the circulation of highly derogatory images and statements about Harris, further entrenching his controversial approach. Despite the backlash, the Trump campaign has not directly addressed concerns about his language, instead focusing on broader policy issues such as border security and the economy. As the election approaches, the impact of Trump's rhetoric on the general electorate remains a critical factor in determining his path forward.